Hello. My name is Joanne, and I am painting today. Right now I'm painting on these little paintings, mini canvases, and that is acrylic paint. I have a larger um, painting behind it, just to make it um, look better <laughs> for you guys. So the one has the dragonflies meeting in the air, and then I have a little shroom village situation going on and they both have shrooms in them and flowers and they are different sizes but this is what is going on and uh, I have lots of glow in the dark on the the bigger of the two with the dragonflies it has some glow in the dark yellow and glow in the dark or neon green fluorescent yellow and green <laughs> All right. Let's see how much time I have. Okay. All right. I'm gonna paint for you for a little bit. There's not a whole lot that I'm gonna do on these right now. As you can see, I've already started doing a lot of things on them. Alright, so I'm going to use a this acrylic paint. It's a real green. Get a little bit of that. And a detailed paintbrush. And come over here. Already added some green glow in the dark. But you can still see the lines. And that was only supposed to be part of the color. So I'm going back over it, this green acrylic paint. Get some paint on my brush. And I apologize if you hear fans in the background. It's quite, it was quite hot today. It's still pretty hot in here. I have total gratitude though. I do realize it's summertime. I'm going to paint some of this on the side so you can see what I'm doing. Alright, I'm going to have to take this for a minute, I apologize. I realize the idea is to paint in front of you guys. However, these paintings are really small. So it's already a challenge for you to do them for you guys. Okay, so I went ahead and did it. I apologize. <laughs> Not showing you my art. Showing you now. What I've done. So I did do more. I want the green that glow in the dark or neon glee, green to show through a little. So I didn't cover it up all the way. So that's for that flower. I'm going to go ahead and turn it back. Okay. I have another flower on the other side. I don't know, I put the flowers on the sides. <laughs> so that's starting to cause a little bit of a problem now. Um, I guess I'll do that off camera. I'm going to come over here to this painting and add some green to these flowers that you can actually see. It's for the side of it right there. Haha. <laughs> okay. Alright. Yep. 
just throwing some green around. This painting is coming, both of these paintings are coming to life. just for my silence. Okay. And try to do the same thing, just leaving uh, some of the neon to come through. Try not to cover it all up, if at all possible. like it. I like what I've done. Go ahead real quick and um, do the side of this painting off camera just that way I can show you kind of what I've done. Even though you can't, you're not really watching me paint it. I apologize for that. Okay. So there's what I've done on the side. Okay. All right. Be careful. I'm starting to stick my finger in the other one. Ha <laughs> ha, in the other green. But it's okay. It's okay. I didn't mess it up. It still looks great. Okay. All right. So, yeah. I don't know how close you guys can see it, but they have little faces that I've already drawn in there. And uh, the minis, like I said, they're just harder to see on camera. So, okay. Hi. I'm going to get this metallic amethyst, what I like to call shiny paint. I still have other colors that I need to figure out. I haven't actually decided what colors yet on certain things. They just usually just kind of come to me. So. onto this flower right here. Attempting to paint this in front of you. Some of my paintings, I like to put things on the edge, on the side, uh, to give the, you know, to give the person um, something else to look at when they think they've seen it all. There's, there's more. There's more on the side. There's more things going on. So, okay, yeah, I like the flower. I like what I've done.
yet. Okay. So I think I'm going to add some more to that to make them kind of match a little. I mean, they both already got the same color kind of thing going on. So I still have this metallic um, amethyst purple color, so I'm going to go over here to this one and add some to this as well. Some polka dots, just little ones. Yeah. Ah. Get this little shroom shroom guy down here. Some awesome amethyst metallic color. And let's see. Just having some color. Sometimes I, I paint over some of it. That's what I feel like doing right now, so that's what's happening. color this flower right here and I actually haven't figured out what color because I already have you know like the reds and the you know, purples and and then I've got the orange background so you know so yeah um, maybe blue I guess I could make a blue flower that kind of sounds sounds good let's see this is called look at me blue I'm gonna go ahead and time. So I'm going to go ahead and paint this flower over here. Put some color to it. Now part of it is on the side. So you see me paint it right here.
outside. She's down here for you guys. I mean, the whole point of this channel is to show you my art, not necessarily to show you me painting it all or creating it all. Um, apologize for getting in front of my camera. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and take this again and um, finish it up. It's a lot easier and faster when I'm not filming it or, well, I'm filming it, but I mean stopping myself from uh, doing it the way I need to do it to make it look correct instead of uh, painting awkwardly for you in a weird position. Okay. I'm almost done. I'll be able to show you something in a minute. I do like this blue color. It is very pretty. I mean, you could almost call it like a medium blue. It's not dark. It's not like the baby blue. And the, the name of it was Look At Me Blue. So it is. It is a Look At Me Blue. Almost done. It's okay. Lots of details for that. Okay. So there is the flower that I just did. Okay, so it's wet. I'm going to put it back over here. Okay. And this blue matches a lot of this, like a lot, the background, so I'm not going to attempt to put really any blue in there. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Ah, uh, can see, I think. Yeah. I guess I lied. I'm adding a little. I'm gonna probably paint over that because see, it matches the background way too much. Okay, cool. Well, just made a short little video. Um, I mean, I guess it's 18 minutes now. It's not that short. So let me get a little bit closer. I know it's still even with me getting close. It's still hard to see exactly what um, I'm doing. But here are my two little acrylic on canvas paintings. Like I said, they're many. You can see by the big canvas of how little they are. So zooming in again. All right, so we have the dragonflies and the shrooms and the flowers. All right. Go ahead and turn this a little and show you what I've done on the sides. All right. Cool. And this one doesn't have as much on the sides. So, all right. So both these paintings are still unfinished. All right. <laughs> thank you for visiting my channel. If you're a subscriber, thank you for subscribing. Appreciate it. All right. I hope everybody's making arts and crafts and painting and yeah. All right. Love and gratitude to everyone. Have a wonderful day.